Hey everybody, Katie Collenberg here, and today I am doing a doTERRA Family Essentials Kit unboxing. So one of the most exciting days for any new oiler is when the oils come in the mail. And so I'm going to show you today what is exactly in a Family Essentials Kit. Um, family Essentials Kit is one of the most popular kits. Um, one of the reasons is it comes with all the top 10 oils that you would want. It's a really great price point. It includes your wholesale fee. So it is one of the most common ones to get, which is why I decided to do the video on this particular kit to show you what's inside, what you're going to get. So they have brand new packaging. Um, this has just been since the fall. It's beautiful, just simple box that you get. Um, it's all wrapped in plastic. So we're gonna take that off. Okay, and let's see, so we're gonna open this up here. And the first thing that I notice is that the lid is really quite heavy. Um, the reason is there's something inside, so we'll have to check that out. But this is what it looks like when you open the box. Just really, really very nicely done. Simple, but really beautiful. So let's take a look at what these different elements are here. So like I said, there's something in the lid. And if you just kind of slide it out, this is one of the most exciting parts of this new update to the kit. And it is the doTERRA Essentials booklet. So you can see it's a nice size, not huge, but big enough to really be able to see. And it's the kind of magazine, heavy magazine weight. And inside is a page on every single one of the oils that you can get with doTERRA. So whether it's rosemary or Hawaiian sandalwood, you get a full description of what exactly the oil is, the main benefits, um, the uses and how you can use it, um, whether you can use it aromatically, topically, internally, and whether you need to dilute it or not. So that is, you'll see right here, aromatic, topic, internal, and the N stands for neat, which means that you can use it straight. You don't have to dilute it. So every single one of the single oils um, and the blends, so here we have, for example, Digest Zen and Elevation. Every single one of those oils has a page in this booklet. Then in the back of the book, they have kits, skincare, all the supplements, um, an explanation of the cleanse. If you're going to do the 30-day cleanse, which I highly recommend, um, there is the explanation of the cleanse and what you will need to do for each of the days. So you can actually keep track of what you're taking each day. The other thing that is in here is in the beginning, an explanation of essential oil application, essential oil safety. So all the things that you would need to know when you first get started. It's not as in depth as the essential life book um, with all the recipes and the very detailed explanations of the body systems. But this is an awesome book that they give you to start out with. I'm very excited to have one myself. Um, explains scientific testing and all sorts of different beginner things about the oils that you'll want in, in, to start with. The other thing that I want to point out is in the center of the book, you still get your stickers, okay? So before it used to come in the white folder that used to come with the kit, now that sticker sheet is right in the center of this booklet. So don't forget to use those either on the tops of your bottles or on your rollers if you wanna remember what's inside. So anyway, that's the booklet that now comes with every enrollment kit that you get with doTERRA. So let's get to the good stuff. So we got our booklet, we know we're gonna look through that and see what we're gonna do. So now we have our oil. So this particular kit comes with two sets of beadlets. Okay, we have 
the peppermint beadlets and the on guard beadlets. Beadlets are tiny gel caps and each one of them has about a quarter of a drop of oil in them. So when you first get them, it will have a little protective seal on the top. So just peel that off. There is about a hundred and, or I don't think about, there are 125 beadlets in this container. So there's quite a few. So what you do is just flip the top, you put some in your hand. If too many come out, you can put them back in. And if you can see that, that is one tiny beadlet, okay? One quarter of a drop of peppermint in this one. So what you can do is, if your stomach isn't feeling good, you could just swallow it. Um, but for me, I mostly use this as a breath freshener um, or to help me wake up because this is powerful peppermint. If you guys like Altoids, forget Altoids. This is way better. This is great, just extreme poof of peppermint in your mouth. So what you do is you put it in your mouth, and you bite down, and then you get a burst of just straight, pure peppermint in your mouth. You can eat whatever you want for lunch at work. Have some onions, go ahead, have some garlic, go ahead, because you can take one or two of these and your breath is totally fresh. Now the other one is the On Guard. Um, this one, as we know, all the great things that On Guard is for, immunity boost, keeping us healthy. Keep this one in your purse. If you are at the movies, if you're on an airplane, if you're at work, somebody's coughing and sneezing behind you, just pop one of these in your mouth. Either bite on it, pop it in your mouth, get a burst of that cinnamon clove On Guard taste. If you're not crazy about it, just swallow it. It still works. Um, so anyway, these are great to have in your bag, in your backpack, in your purse. Just a very convenient way to get a quick, quick dose of oils there. So that's a bonus. Those only come in this particular kit. Um, maybe some of the bigger ones, but uh, this one has the beadlets. That's one of the special things about this kit, but you can order them separately too. So last but not least. So here is the actual Family Essentials kit. On the back, it shows a picture of all your oils that you're getting. And then it also has a description of each one. So if you are kind of forgetting, oh gee, what was frankincense for? Um, just a little quick reminder, it'll say on here, help support cellular health. Is that everything that frankincense does? No, no, not at all. But you can also look in your booklet that you just got, and then you can also go on to Facebook, onto groups and um, read about it in other ways as well. So once I open that up, this slides out of that little case. And now we have this. this is the actual kit. It's got a little magnet flip. And that opens up here. Okay. And there are my oils. And this little piece of paper just came out of the top, so let's see what this is. It says doTERRA Family Essentials Kit. Oh, cool. So in here, we have a nice cheat sheet. Keep a hand on this one because this will come in handy, guys. This is a little cheat sheet to tell you what each one of these oils is, what you would use it for, and how you can use it. So it's a smaller version of what you would find in here. Just keep that paper in here so in the beginning when you're not sure and you're nervous that you're going to do something wrong, just grab this sheet and it'll give you a little reminder. Um, there's really no, no wrong way to use these oils. Just don't stick them in your eyes. <laughs> so what are we going to get? Let's go through these real quick. So our first oil, these are what I like to call our first aid oils. So basically... Um, some of the oils are more suited toward emotional use. Some of them are suited, what I feel is more toward your everyday aches and pains and cuts and bruises and things like that. And that's what these oils are. They're the top 10 oils, the ones that you will use the most often, especially if you've got kids running around and everybody, just your day-to-day -day stuff. So lavender, Swiss Army oil. This guy cuts, burns, of course relaxation, of course sleep. 
great for kids, even pets. It's very relaxing, um, good for anything for the skin, any kind of rashes or itches, mosquito bites. I could go on and on about lavender. Um, pretty commonly known oil, um, great one to have in your arsenal. Next is lemon. Lemon is great for all sorts of cleaning. So whether you are um, dusting or getting scratches out of wood, whether you're getting sticky residue off of something or cleaning your oven, all sorts of excellent ways to clean with lemon. It also cleans your inside. So if you put a drop in some water, you're getting a light liver detox and um, it's just a great way to drink more water, tastes great. You're getting the oils from the rind of the lemon, not the juice, so there are more health benefits as well. And next is peppermint. So I just had a burst of peppermint with the beadlet. Peppermint is great for stomach issues. It's also great as a pick-me-up to help you wake up. You can cook with it. Great in the diffuser. I love to add peppermint to just about everything because it just makes everything more um, vibrant. It's a great um, oil just to open up your passageways and help you breathe and very good for cooling down too. A little drop on a bandana around your neck in the summertime cools you right down. Next is breathe. Breathe is basically the one that opens up all your airways. So whether you have any kind of respiration or breathing issues, you know, put this on before you go to bed, helps um, breathe, you know, breathe through the night, whether you put it in the diffuser or whether you rub it on your chest. This one is a strong oil. You probably want to dilute it, especially on little ones, um, but it is one of my absolute favorites for any time I have a stuffy nose. Next is, Cool. Deep blue. Deep blue is for muscle pain. So this one I do recommend um, to dilute it only because one, it is a tingly oil, but it's a lot easier to massage it in that way. So if you have a carrier oil, preferably fractionated coconut oil, but you could also use almond oil or olive oil, put some drops in your hand, some of the carrier oil, and massage it into any sore or achy muscles, um, and then cover it to keep it warm, and you'll just feel that soak right into the muscles and feel wonderful. Um, next is Melaleuca. Melaleuca is more commonly known as tea tree. Uh, tea tree is another commonly known oil like lavender. Um, you've probably seen it in shampoo or face um, products. That's because it's great for everything skin, everything. Um, it's got antifungal properties. So whether you're keeping your toenails clean, whether you are um, you have any kind of itchy skin, um, Melaleuca is great for all those things. Personally, I use Melaleuca for itchy eyes. No, I am not putting it in my eyes, but I put it around my eyes when I have seasonal itchy eyes and it does the trick like nobody's business. One of my absolute favorite oils. We call it the Aussie first aid kit. So next is frankincense. Frankincense, the king of oils. I'm not going to go into all the details about frankincense because there is so many wonderful and amazing properties that it has, but it is good for cellular health, anything skin related, um, aches and pains, I use it drop under my tongue when I have anything hurting in my head. Um, it's a wonderful oil. It's also one of the more expensive oils. So I do like to point out that it is a great deal that you get frankincense in this kit because if you buy it on your own, it can be more, well, it will be more expensive than some of the other oils like lemon or even peppermint or lavender. So Definitely take advantage of the kit and having these all together to have some of these more expensive oils in there as well. Oregano. So oregano, of course, for cooking. It's really strong, guys. Don't even put a drop. Just take a toothpick, touch it in, and stir it in because it's super, super strong. Great for everything respiratory. Yes, you will smell like oregano. So mix this with a little bit of um, coconut oil put it on the soles of your feet and then put some socks on or put another oil over it. 
if you're not crazy about the smell, but it works wonderfully for respiration, for coughs, um, and any kind of just getting rid of the gunk, we say, you know, so anything that you want to um, get rid of, whether you're adding this to a, a, a sneezing and cough blend or something like that, oregano will help clear out your system. It's also a good one, a part of the cleanse. Um, that one's a great one to have. And Digestin. This is the Everything Stomach Blend, guys. It's the one I say I wish I didn't need because nobody wants to have stomach issues. Nobody wants to have heartburn or nausea or all those other fun things, but it's going to happen. And when it happens, just rub some of this on your stomach or on your chest, wherever it's bothering you, and it works right away. This one you, you, this one is very, very important to have because nobody wants to feel sick. That's the worst. Um, it tastes and smells like black licorice. You either like that or you don't. If you don't, like I said, just rub it on your stomach. You don't have to take it internally. If you do like black licorice, go for it. You can either put a drop in some water or um, you can just put a drop under your tongue. Last but not least in this lovely kit of 10 is On Guard. On Guard is the Everything Immunity Blend. This is the one that is the one that's going to put the bubble around you in the winter time. If, especially this winter, cold, flu, all those terrible, grunky things that are out in the air, we want to protect ourselves from them. So what I suggest is having this in the diffuser all the time. You can put a drop in your hands, rub your hands together. You can take those beadlets that you got. Um, you can make a roller bottle <clears throat> with some of these other oils to make an immunity blend. All sorts of things for On Guard. So many products made with On Guard. You can make household sprays, many, many different things. This is definitely not only one of the best ones to have um, in the wintertime, but it also smells great. If you put this in the diffuser, wild orange, cinnamon, clove, this blend smells awesome. So it's such a good one to to smell anyway, even if it didn't have all those other great benefits. So whew, that is the top 10 oils in the Family Essentials Kit. You might notice that the bottles look a little bit smaller than the traditional 15 mil size. That's because these guys are all five mil size. That's why the kit is a little bit less expensive, but it's a great way to start. You know, these are good ones to, to kind of get your feet wet, see what you like, see what you, um, can get used to using and then um, go from there. So if you have questions then about this kit, now you have this and you've opened it up and you've got all this stuff in front of you, watch my other video that is, I have my oils, now what? That'll go into more detail about what to do once you've opened your kit and you've unboxed it. Now what, now what do you do? So if you um, don't have this kit yet, or any of the other enrollment kits from doTERRA, please comment below, let me know, and I can help point you in the right direction, get you some more information. And um, if you have any other questions, again, comment below, and uh, I will do my best to answer them. Please like and share and comment if you felt like this was helpful, and tag your friends if they're interested uh, in doTERRA, and they might be interested in getting a family essentials kit for themselves. Um, I hope that you enjoyed that and that you guys have a great day. Thanks so much and see you next time.